Welcome back to Let's Play Spyro 2, Ripto's Rage Reignited. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we're here in Breeze Harbor, where last time I accidentally, uh, helped the Breeze Builders prepare for an attack on Zephyr, so now I'm officially working both sides of a war. No. Off you go, then. You know, it's funny. I remember looking at this guy and thinking that the platform was further away. Please excuse the mess, Spyro. We are currently suffering from a land blubber infestation. First, they put out the fires in our boilers, and now they've shut down our ship, too. I don't think it's weird that for all the military and Rambo theming they've got going on with these guys, the only actual piece of equipment they're carrying is a bedroll and a canteen. If you could stoke up the fires under the boilers, I'm sure you could make your way to the ship. The steam from the boilers will activate our highly advanced machinery. I mean, not to mention that birds do not sleep lying down. They sleep sitting down, so they don't need bedrolls. Oh, I see it's also attached to a backpack, but still, that is clearly a bedroll at the top. Oh, okay. I couldn't remember if that was one thing or not. Problem solved. Ah, uh, yes, the firefighter fighter joke. Oh, yeah! Shit, I forgot about that. I killed one of those things and it started counting, so I need to find the guy who wants him dead. Oh, I actually had a comment there. But uh, I guess this guy needs to be uh, incinerated first. It's clearly he wasn't paying attention to whose territory this is now. Fire, not water. <laughs> uh... Let me see. Hmm. Yes, yeah, sorry, I, uh... Had some trouble with my phone there. Ahem! Wanted to give a shout-out to Yornik, who left the following comment. You know, I think the developers missed a chance to get even more cuteness out. Just imagine if Zilwee would get a new outfit for each world. Something like a bikini for the beach, or a fluffy fur coat for these frozen lands. Uh, that was in the video where I was in... I... Oh, uh, the, the Glacier level. Uh, Crystal Glacier. Oh, yes. And I think there's just nothing down there anymore, so sure. What is up with this? Nothing led to this. Oh, let's not do that, after all. Well, that sure looks like a collectible. And that sure looks like a collectible. Where the hell? No. Ow. Yes, yeah, very funny. I hope it will uh, keep you warm as you plummet to your death. Ooh, that was not intentional. I just wanted to smack him. I kind of thought he would... Hey, that guy has a quest! Oh dear, he looks very stressed. Those land blubbers have littered these metal spike mines all over the harbor. If you can clear them out, I'll give you this orb I found in a clam yesterday. Was it that clam? Because he seems really worried about something. So, the bucket things left these around? I didn't even think they were intelligent. Just, you know, irritating. Look out below! Oh.
I could shoot that, but... I don't think the gems would despawn. It's... Ah! What the fuck, camera? I'm not even gonna burn that guy. He has too many problems. He's gonna backtrack a little. There were a bunch of those guys in this level. Also, you know, I kind of need to take care of this guy anyway, so... What the hell? Oh, right, down and up or reverse. My bad! Am I even aiming at the right area? Yeah, he's there. And I did hit something. That didn't think that would work. I don't know, the sparkles went higher than that. Thought maybe we could use it to get some, you know, height for over there. I've got a comment with the hover move, too, but, uh... For the moment, let's just keep going. All right, I kind of forgot they stop. Like, civilized vehicles. Huh. What are you doing here? I thought the uh, birds and the grubs were at war. No, thank you for that. Oh, there was a thing I forgot to look up. Actually, I suddenly remembered the uh, the hose guy there reminds me of it. Does this kill you, or do I have to knock you off a cliff? No, it kills you. Okay. I am curious. Ah, oh, damn it! I had the I had the opposite of what I wanted to do there. I wanted to burn that to see if the fireman would actually put it out, or if it's just the uh, the the blubber guys who are that proactive. Okay, here it is. Shout out to Miracle Tiger for uh, informing me that in the original version of Spyro 2, those guys in Scorch who had slingshots were actually just carrying rifles. Which would explain why they were carrying the slingshots like rifles. How odd. He also added that, uh, yeah, corrected a thing I said earlier, the first boss of the first game was not Scorch, it was Toasty. Still similar. Oh, I see. Yes. Have to do the thing again. So I'll just do this and wait for the bucket guy to come along. Oh, no, right. That's, yeah. Yeah, I forgot. You have to chase this one. Because the rules are different. I really don't get how you think that, uh... Oh. Spraying water at a guy in a bucket of water is going to accomplish anything, but hey, that's just me. 
All right, ready to attack. Let's see about those wings. Huh, still doesn't look high enough to get me over there. Oh, I see! Yeah, that would do it. What on the other side? Where does that go? They did miss that gem right there, so that's interesting. Thanks for getting our ship fired up, Spyro. Now we can proceed yes, with our yes. counterattack on Zephyr. Please take this talisman as a token of our gratitude. If you insist. Ooh, doubles. Well, yes, but he forgot, so, you know, I'm not going to take that away from him. I mean, technically, I already took it away from him. Oh, yeah, the other one goes nowhere. Okay. I guess the wing is just there to get me back. How lucky for me that you came along. My machinery is broken, and the gears I need to repair it are scattered all over the tracks. Can you hop on that trolley up there and collect them for me? Fifty? Okay. Not in love with that, but, uh... I'm kind of in love with the trolley part even less, so we'll work on it. Oh. Oh, good. with the trolley, eh? Well, use the left stick to change lanes. Press the jump button to jump, and press the attack button to fire the cannon. I didn't realize that was a cannon. Okay. That, pro that will probably help. Why didn't you mention that the first time? Not much of a cannon. Crap. I was going to loop. It'll be fine. Uh, what happened to those gems? Oh fuck! I shifted directly into it. Well, at least it's not damaging me or taking away lives. I think. I do have to get all of them, which is a bummer. God damn it, why didn't that explode when I shot it? What is the thing for if that's not what it's f if that's not what it's for? Blah. Yeah, still better this than the uh, the flight levels in the first game. That was trial and error, and you had to find the path. And I can't turn here because of that sign. I did try to jump over that. That was unfortunate. Why are they so shiny anyway? Yeah, fuck whoever was on that crane. Oh! I'm not actually sure what happened there, so you can go fuck yourself. And I'll just go back to these gems and be on my way. Because there's uh, still those mine guys to blow up. Admittedly, it would help if I could get out of that room. Oh, I see. Done. Thanks, 
Thanks, Spyro. Here's that orb I promised. Sorry if it still has clam juice on it. Ew. I want to point out that he did say the other day when he was talking about that, which means he just never washed it. Sorry, Zoe, that was the wrong button. Oh no, it's going backwards. Shite! I don't remember if I have to go through the portals or not in order to keep the gems I earned. I also don't know how to get there, since it turns out that's just a mini game track. Uh, get there, I mean, just here. Yeah, it is faster. Than swimming on the surface, I mean. Oh, come on, really? That's how that ends? With the track ending nowhere, and I guess I have to. Yeah, okay. What's after that, or that has to be the 50th one? See, that right there felt like boarding a train at the last second before the door is closed. Strangely satisfying, even though you didn't actually do anything. Alright, here's the portal. So I've got stuff to do. It does say return home. Well, that guy's no longer alive. Oh no. Ah, uh, twenty one seventy six, the year the robots take over. A good summer for wine. Uh, a number of people have pointed out to me, oh, it's actually right there, that I can uh, use the uh, this menu to just travel there uh, at will. So if I wanted to, I could just immediately go to Glimmer. Nice. Um, <laughs> I'm actually returning to Zephyr, even though I got a bunch of stuff there, because I didn't get everything there. Uh, I actually have a comment <laughs> about that. Uh, 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 real quick... Ah, yes, here it is. Shout out again to Miracle Tiger, who said, When you left Zephyr without pursuing the pot, I felt my stomach scream in agony. Rest in peace, bunch of gems. Yeah, the question mark pot, I totally forgot about that. Let's remedy that. I realized that as I was going over the footage after the fact, and I was just, ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't end well for that guy. All right. Okay, Spyro. This part Looks sucks. Like this opening area kind of sucks, and all the missiles and here. stuff. The breeze builders have got us pinned down, and we've been waiting for. I don't actually know what uh, these guys are called. The bug guys. Building. Looks like you're it. Oh, that is how it works. The uh, the the flying dudes throw them the missiles, and they belch them out. Ow. I feel like that has to be a reference to uh, adult birds feeding their babies by vomiting in their mouths, but I'm not sure how. Nope. I mean, the nature documentaries usually use the word regurgitate. Let's be honest, we all know what's happening here. This is not a special thing, only birds do. It 
It's not like a bird can choose to swallow its food into either its stomach or a blender. <laughs> oh, you came back already, thanks. Sorry about that, by the way. May your respawn be glorious. Oh, hey. That's awfully convenient. I don't know why you do that, but I don't mind. Problem solved. Okay. Why are those going anyway? Oh, right, to the gates. Yes, that would do it. Um. Well. The timer has gone, so I'm just going to call it here amongst the thatched roof cottages and say I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you next time on Let's Thank Play... Oh. For me. Do you think you can blast that bird, soldier? Jump up here and give it a try. On Let's Play Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage. Oh, reignited. <laughs> Later.